You know, I started to be a pirate the day after 9-11. As soon as I watched those towers come down, I said, that is a controlled demolition and there is a scam going on. And the next day I sent out an email to my closest network, not many, maybe 70 people, stating what I thought. And I didn't quite comprehend the response. I had sent it to everyone, CC instead of BCC, so someone did a reply to all and then questioned my sort of drug addiction, like with marijuana, so that's the only one I really have. And then there's a bit of a, an argument over whether I was or wasn't, but no one brought up what I had said. And later on, I realized I lost most of those friends because I don't think they were really able to handle uh, such an interpretation so quickly to the event. Now it's how many years later, 16 years later, and there's more than enough evidence to show that it was an inside job. But to tell people at that time, I was like a crazy guy. And now, it's the internet, more and more we see the false flags, more and more we see all the evidence that shows the, the utter bullshit that is usually fed to us by the powers that be. And I'm saying this because this piracy to declare your sovereignty to say that I am no longer participating in what you are putting forward because you guys are criminals. That whole thing about 9-11 is the event of the 21st century. It is the pinnacle evidence that we are living in a world based upon bullshit and that if you agree to it your soul is going to decay you have to be living in alignment with your own integrity and if people are feeding you lies and you know their lies and yet you still go along with them it's pretty difficult to exist for yourself over time and the reason I keep in Facebook or in different social circles bring up 9-11 is because I know that if that is ever brought to the surface for the whole world to participate in the watching of the investigation by true, competent, impartial, neutral people and then the answers given, the solution given our species is going to change because the people behind 9-11, they're the people behind every false flag there is. They're the people that are manufacturing the wars. They are the people that are pulling the strings on all of the leaders of all these governments. They're the hidden international bankers and they belong to certain groups which you can't be named, but they are the ones that are just royally screwing our species. And so, you have to somehow symbolically address this. And as an individual, we, we may feel like there's nothing we can do. But to me, even if it's a hat, even if it's glasses, we distinguish ourselves from the norm. We take ourselves out of what everyone else is doing. And we stand there like a beacon saying, you've got to look at this. You've got to look at this. And when the whole species turns our attention and looks at this event and uses it as the mechanism to trace back to the criminals, to trace back to those that got away with the largest crime of the century, that is what we have to do. And that is one part of the very secret plan.